Streams louder. Hello and welcome to the Trail of Your Voice podcast. You join me here now on your streaming choice to review the magnificent Wonder Woman 19. 19- Eighty-four. My life hasn't been what you probably think it has. We all have our struggles. Have you ever been in love? A long, long time ago. You? So many times. Yeah, all the time. <laughs> Welcome to the future. Life is good, but it can be better. And why shouldn't it be? All you need is to want it. Think about finally having everything you always wanted. I can save today, but you can save the world. I take what I want in return. Everyone will see. The world needs you. You know what you need to do. Nothing good is born from lies. And greatness is not what you think. It's all art. It's, uh... That's just a trash can. It's just a trash can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And as you saw there, beautiful woman in her prime, not at all being drilled over by two men in a small room. And holy shit, my girl swings from lightning bolts! Boom! Goddamn. She swings from lightning bolts. <laughs> I'm sorry. We've but had so, holy shit, man. so like, many trailers drop in the last couple of weeks. Mate, Marvel this one is so pissed off that this didn't one. get that first. I'm so, Marvel's looking at now thinking we did car flips, we did sky beams, yeah. we, did, we did nanotech. Someone's like right now, Marvel's running around and goes, who the fuck missed swinging from lightning bolts? Okay, like, you know what I mean? I'll put a Why billion dollars on the table. Get someone yeah, to swing. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Oh, man. He's the god of lightning. <laughs> How did you not think of this? Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, man. Oh, man. man nah, this trailer. This... It's got hype written all over it. Definitely, man. Got the full on music and sound is definitely getting a star because um, nothing more nostalgia than. than... Mate, that music. How does it feel? Yeah. Down out, down out. Oh, no, man. Just uh, awesome. I've still got the beat in my head now. Just <laughs> going on, like. Yeah. Um, the graphics, I mean, oh my god, I'm, I'm still too hyped, man. Like, man honest the the colour tones first. of a suit are still amazing oh, in the scenes. Dude, honest to god. And the suit still looks really badass. Yeah. Like, not too effeminate, but like genuinely badass. She's got some man. new tricks coming out the bag. Oh, shit, yeah, with a whipping thing. Like, yeah. I mean, rope. Rope, <laughs> sorry. Oh. I'm getting excited <laughs> yeah, sorry, now, bro. Sorry, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this, is a, this is a kid's show now, bro. Yeah, yeah like, <laughs> I'm sorry. You all know what I'm saying. No, um, no, 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 yeah, 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 man. Yeah, with the uh, rope. That's what I said the first time, man. Dude, <laughs> you know what I mean? like, I'm so intrigued. This um, trailer, I have so many questions. Um, again, Chris Pine. Casting-wise, Chris Pine want to know what's going on because he's still just as young, which yeah. means, you know, from 19 to 19, 1940s. No, sorry, earlier than that. 
30s. I don't know. I don't know. It's World War One to 20s. Okay. Sorry, should I say 1920s to 84. It's not age, which is incredible. Obviously, Diana doesn't age because, you know. She's a wonder woman. Yeah. Yep. Uh, but my man Pedro yeah. Pascal, fucking love that guy. Chris Pine, just is one of the Chris's. He's like, he's he like is, the man. Infinity Jet Stones, isn't he? Yeah. You know what I mean? He's yep. one of the Chris's. Um, I think... <laughs> Yeah, and then um, Christina Wig. Oh man, I love Kevin Feige. Right, is literally um, <laughs> Thanos collecting the Chris's. That's what's going that's on. What, that's and what I'm telling you, right? Honestly, that's what I'm saying. That's like, the last gem. Chris's the time stone. That's Mate, what he that's is. What that's what what he what he is. why he hasn't aged. So glad you put. You said he was a time stone. I thought you were saying the mind stone. No, it's the I time like, stone. Man. I was like, don't compare it to that. Man. <laughs> and I was like, don't do it, man. No, it's a time stone all day. <laughs> um, also, Robin Wright in this, who's a fa- just a fantastic... Um, if, if you've not watched House of Cards, I know a bit controversial with Kevin Spacey, but honestly, it's it's um, it's basically Game of Thrones, but in the White House. And um, she takes on she takes on the mantle after they, mm. you know, promptly get him out of that series. And she is a phenomenal actress, so... I'm, I'm looking forward to, to Kristen Wiig's portrayal of Cheetah. Yeah, man. She's Cheetah, like, a really good actor. Dude, like, got... you've said it, and the first thing I did was, like, nearly snap my neck to yeah. look at you and say, nah, they're having Cheetah in this, like, yeah. which, again, is a bit of a DC boy. It's like, holy shit, man, yeah. like, ah, oh, but this is, um, no, this looks wicked. I mean, the storyline, yeah, all right, yeah, it's, it's got to be cut and dry. There's a bad guy she's going to have to fight, but, again, there's the whole, because of what we know about the Justice League. Yeah. Like, um, they did that little thing where they, you know, they show her, Taking the cameras out, like because she still yeah. doesn't want to be known as as a Wonder Woman, Woman. so to yeah, speak, as yeah. a superhero. So no, I think it still leaves a lot of questions. Like and again, like, well, what, how did this guy yeah. come back? How is he just come back? Like, you know what I mean? Not age a day. It's really hard to, to decide what's going on here because you see him actually fighting at some point in the trailer. You see him punch That's somebody. That's what I'm saying. So. Think, how have they tricked her into thinking that he's back? That's a Curious That's, question. Yeah, yeah. Or is it a clone? Because at first, she's being used, like you don't know. Well, at first, you think, is it all in her mind? Is it like he's yeah, in her mind? Yeah. He's there. Yeah, it could be. You know, yeah. from her perspective. Yeah. If it was saw through someone else's eyes, perspective yeah. point of view, she's just talking to herself in the middle of a room. But through her eyes, he's there. But then you see him punch someone, and he makes you think, okay, so something's going on here. So I mean, plot wise, sound wise, graphic wise. And Good, editing wise, so it's going to be a five star one because I absolutely hundred fucking there's percent. No way, it's not five star. Going to go and see this film. So there's none of this. Does it make you want to see it? it like, if there's any way I could get early access yeah. to watching it now, I would like. And yeah. I've got to be honest with you, I feel like Wonder Woman's. See, Wonder Woman has a bit of a. I don't know if this is true for Damien, but Wonder Woman has a special like place in my soul because it was the first good DC, E like you know DC universe film they did. Yeah. Yeah. It was like Man of Steel was a bit over the top. Okay. I liked it, but no, it was just. I think we've come to a great to disagree point there, but I, I agree with you. Wonder no, Woman was, was the first one. No, it was a quality film. It yeah. was just a bit over the top with the buildings and stuff. I think Batman v Superman was just there was there's too much to even talk about right now, so mm. I'm not going to address that package. It's a whole other. Um, the Justice League was like, why the fuck have we skipped to what what that? Huh? Yeah, uh, and just was poor. And then Wonder Woman came out, and it was like, holy shit, that's, this is a quality, like, Solid. this is a great film. So, um, and then Aquaman landed, and that turned out to be really good too. So for me, like, this was the first step in the right direction mm. for the DC universe. Is it Themyscira, the birthplace? Themyscira, yeah. I like her that seemed to be having flashbacks of her as a, it's a girl it's still included, again. yeah. Yeah, yeah Which, I do, yeah. Like I said, it seems as though she's she might be in a battle struggling, but she's having to remember her training and what she did to get she learnt yeah, yeah, for or, this type of scenario. Or, yeah, well, there's, yeah, there's a certain task she completes, and it just gives her a flashback yeah. to when she first learned yeah. how to do it's these cool, sort man. of moves. Well, it just keeps it tied in, like you know what yeah, I mean, like yeah. in the sense of, I don't know, look, man, it's a superhero film. What superhero don't have flashbacks for fuck's sake? I yeah. mean, come on. I mean, they even tried to get around that with um, Civil War. Well, instead of having flashbacks of a fucking hologram technology, like, come on, like, it's... Do you think they'll ever introduce Wonder Woman's Invisible Plane? Or do you reckon that's taking it too far? Shit, man, swing some lightning, the fuck she ain't in Invisible uh, Plane, poor fam, like, Can she not what? fly? She can fly, can't she? Oh, it depends that's one of her on the material. source material, which okay. cartoons, which comics, like, it does Okay, depend. this is what I was going to ask, yeah, yeah has she always been able to fly, or is it just depending on the, on the, yeah, on the yeah. source depends, material? Depends, yeah, like I said, depends on which sort of... Okay. Which yeah. build-up, or which sort of thing... I personally like the idea of her getting an invisible plane, personally. 
don't know how they're going to do it, though, man. Oh, man, they'll come all the way, is it? Uh, Mate, don't know how they're going to do it. You're not seen Tony Stark in the man, I know there's clever Iron minds of me and you out there that are going to figure this out, but right, I kind well, of feel like they're in the right all direction. All I'll say is, all I'll say is, please, please support your local cinemas. Go and watch this film in the cinema. For sure. This is a cinematic film to watch. Like the, the graphics, the, the effects, the, yeah. the sound, the, just the visuals, everything that they've done has been made to be viewed in a cinema yeah. setting and you'll enjoy it far more. So that's all, because not that I've got any ties to it or anything, but I'm certainly not getting a fucking paycheck cut to me to say I this. think Chris Pine's character, um, just coming back, will add a bit of comedic value to, to the... Uh tone of the film maybe he does comedic um, he, he yeah. does comedic and stoic very well yeah like if you've ever watched him in the Star Trek yeah. obviously you have yeah, yeah. Um, and just in, in some of his other films he's he's a solid actor and he knows his, he knows his timing mm. um, he's a bit too I don't know it's weird like any personal sort of stuff I've seen of him he seems very quiet which is you know, it's, you know there's nothing against the guy like he seems to keep his also, personal life to his personal life. major question Cheetah yep um, will they make it a mixture of her being a cheater and human or will they just stick, it as just a stick her in a leopard costume or what? I'm interested man you know I want to see what they're going to do what? if Chris Pine's in it and he's still young I like the idea of genetic manipulation and cloning yes, going I do. on so I, I do. like the idea that she sort of transforms into cheater yeah like you know a bit like a banner to man, that'd be awesome I want that to be the case that, some sort of genetic transformation well hope so man that's, that's the beauty about this trailer that's, and why, I don't that's want... why I'm so hope because it's like it could yeah. be it could be like... and I don't want her to be killed off as a character I want them to learn the lessons in these superhero films and actually have her be defeated in whatever way but she carries away and comes back it, another day depends doesn't it because we've already gone for another fight but we've already seen Justice League haven't we so they are kind of limited and what they can do with Diane and her bad guys. Yeah, but and just, stuff. just because Cheetah wasn't in Justice League. Well, they could make Cheetah a mantle. The Cheetah could be a mantle that's passed down. Like, if it's Possibly. genetic and it's in a blood, her daughter could have it and, you know, have a whole revenge thing going on. You don't know, do you? Yeah, could be. But like, no. I mean, I'm, shit, I'm really there's me just doing a bit of thinking for I'm you, really DC. Keen. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can have that one for fucking free. <laughs> um, but yeah, that, that's, that's, um, that's all said from here, guys. Please go watch in your local cinema. Definitely a five star trailer, and I'm betting money. Good money, it's going to be a five star film. So, yep, I've been Alex for Trailer View Boys. I've been Damien, and we'll catch you on the next one. Make the streams louder.